Feature for feature, Babco Air's new pancake two-cylinder is clearly superior. Let's take a closer look inside Fabco Air's new Pancake 2 cylinder and compare it to the competition. Let's start with the rod. The competition features a 303 stainless ground rod, which is basically just a ground rod with a surface finish of 20 RMS. It's a simple 303 stainless shaft. Fabco's Pancake 2 rod is manufactured with hard chrome-plated stainless steel 303. The finish is 8 to 12 RMS with Duralon rod bearing and the machined O-ring groove for the O-ring. The competition uses an oil impregnated bronze rod bushing. Notice there are two of these bushings. The bushing closest to the end of the cylinder is actually captured. There is a chamfer on the bearing and a lip on the aluminum cylinder head to keep the bearing from going out the end of the cylinder. However, the inner bearing is not retained or mechanically staked. Having two bearings that are pressed in and a free O-ring groove could cause a tight or sloppy groove if the bearing links vary to any degree. The O-rings are buna in and are not internally lubricated. Fabco's Pancake 2 uses a Duralon rod bearing and hard chrome-plated rod, which work together well. Over the cycle life of the cylinder, the non-metallic bearing surface burnishes the rod compared to metal-to-metal -metal scoring of the competitor's bronze bearing against the ground 303 stainless shaft. As the cylinder cycles, the Duralon bearing, which carries 60,000 PSI, as opposed to 4,500 PSI of the competitors, actually polishes the hard chrome-plated shaft. Another feature to compare is the piston assembly. In the competitor's cylinder, the piston assembly is swaged into a countersink on the piston head, leaving a relatively small amount of engagement. The fact that the material's been moved makes for a worked hardened area where the orbital riveting has been done. In some applications, we have seen extremely high cycle rate coupled with the load, causing failure of the orbital riveting with its small area of contact. The stainless steel shaft pounds into the aluminum piston head and play develops over the course of a number of cycles. That work hardened piece will eventually break off and the piston shaft will exit the cylinder. Fabco's Pancake 2 piston assembly is a three piece assembly with counter board and countersunk piston head, piston shaft, and alloy flathead screw that is loctited and torqued, providing superior engagement. Also worth mentioning is that Buna N O-rings are used in the competition cylinders. A great compound, but one which requires a lot of lubrication. The standard lube that comes with this competitor cylinder is a thicker honey-type lubrication. MagnaLube G lubrication is an optional feature. Fabco's Pancake 2 dynamic O-ring seals, both the piston head and the piston shaft O-ring seals, are internally lubed Buna-N O-rings with MagnaLube G as standard pre-lube. MagnaLube G has microscopic Teflon particles in it, which impregnate themselves in the porous areas of the cylinder barrel. Take a look at the competition's rear cover. The rear cover is thin, and the air enters the cylinder through a milled relief, weakening the already thin cover. That makes for an even weaker point under continuous cycling. When the cylinder is mounted on the rod end, you get a coining of the rear cover. This results in breakage of the rear cover, allowing air to release and total failure of the unit. This is a typical example of a blowout of a rear cover. What happens usually is they'll be mounted on the rod end and a standard cylinder with a thin cover will fracture or crack under a high cycle rate and blow out the rear cover. The Fabco Air Pancake 2 rear cover is much thicker than the competition. We did this to prevent impact blowout. The competition's stainless steel cylinder wall is extremely thin and has a higher probability of denting which ultimately will cause cylinder failure. The mirrored finish bore leaves no place for lubrication to lie. 
As a result, the O-ring passes, wipes the lube off, and makes for a fairly dry surface. Fabco's Pancake 2-cylinder barrel is a high-strength composite barrel. It's self-lubricating, and the extremely smooth interior with a low coefficient of friction gives you minimal heat buildup and zero slipstick. The competitor uses carbon alloy bolts, which are susceptible to rust, while Fabco's Pancake 2 totally interchangeable cylinder uses rust-resistant stainless steel tie bolts, which are larger for additional strength. Feature for feature, Fabco's Pancake 2 cylinder wins hands down with superior design and construction. Make the Pancake 2 your premium choice for performance and long-lasting durability.